one good hacker and a hack bot system working together will be able to out hack almost everyone from a volume perspective. And, and that's what I believe. I mean, if I could feed you a list, Justin, of like, I don't know, 10 potential XSS and 10 potential CSP and 10 potential RCE via command injection. And you're literally just like betting them like, oh yeah, that one is a bug. Nope, that one's not. Yeah, that one is. If they're actually a decently high signal, even if it's only like 30% accurate, like you would be able to make a lot of money <laughs> from just like yeah. reviewing bugs. And it's almost like what we see with the um, critical thinkers hack alongs, right? Is like, yeah. Um, you know, with the Hacksley, we have a ton of super talented hackers, yes. um, you know, participating in the hack and, and in the critical thinking discord. But I've been surprised by a couple people that, I, that, you know, I would, I would consider as like solid mid, like intermediate yeah. hackers, right. Mm -hmm. You know, that really are getting really good at some stuff, but are definitely fresher on the scene. Right. Yep. Um, and you know, when we're hacking together, I'm going down one route and then almost every single time somebody will drop in the chat and be like, Hey, look at this sketchy thing that I just found. Yep. Right. So if, if, and I just love that, right. Because it's like, okay. And then, you know, I'll take that and close the loop on it and exploit it or yep. something like that. Or maybe somebody else who's better than me in the sure. chat will do it, you know, and, and it happens almost every time we do a hack. Yep. Right. And, and I think that if, if just applying this to AI, if you can get the AI to be at, at a level of like a, a intermediate hacker, as far as like, um, intuition of whether a functionality is sketchy or not, mm -hmm. then essentially hacking becomes, here's a bunch of leads from an intermediate hacker, skilled hacker. Now your job is to be the closer.